Recently, we made a video on how to remove ads from a Xiaomi smartphone. Today, we are going to take that a step further. Hey guys, my name is Shivam and I will tell you how to remove bloatware from a MIUI 12 device without rooting your smartphone. First, let's talk about the simple method of removing bloatware from your MIUI 12 device that can be done right from your smartphone. No laptops, no PCs required. First, figure out the apps that came preloaded with your Xiaomi smartphones. The newer smartphones come with fewer pre-installed apps. So for instance, the Redmi 9 Power that I have only came with Netflix, Facebook, LinkedIn, Mi Remote, Mi Credit and Mi Doc Viewer as the extra third-party apps. Removing them is straightforward. Just go to Settings, then Apps, then Manage Apps, and then tap Uninstall. Now just select the apps and then tap Uninstall All. Before we move on to the next method, let me remind you to like this video if you found it useful and also consider subscribing to our channel and hitting that bell icon so that you're always notified of our latest videos. Now while the method of uninstalling apps right from your smartphone is pretty accessible and somewhat effective, you may still end up with some services running in the background. To get a deeper cleanse, you'll have to connect your smartphone to a PC. Now, for the sake of this demonstration, I have connected my smartphone to a Windows system because I only have a Windows laptop. But you can also connect your smartphone to a Mac system by using a software called Homebrew. In this demonstration, since we are connecting to Windows, we will be using a thing called ADB or Android Debugging Bridge. Now, a very important thing to note over here before we continue with this method is that even though it doesn't require routing, it doesn't mean that it is completely safe. You need to make sure that you know what you're removing. There are certain services and apps that when removed may completely break your smartphone and if not, they may make you lose some key functionality like making calls or sending texts. So just be very sure that the services or the apps that you are removing are the ones that you actually want to remove and also i have actually added a list of apps that will tell you which ones to remove and which ones to not remove which ones to avoid so just make sure you know what you're doing great now first up you will have to enable developer options on your smartphone to do this, go to settings, then tap on about phone and then tap on the MIUI version 7 times. Once this is done, go to additional settings and then tap on developer options. Here enable USB debugging. This will make sure that you connect to a PC properly. Now download ADB on Windows using the link that's appearing on the screen about now. You will also find it in the description. It's a zip file so you'll have to extract it using a file archiver like 7-zip or WinRAR. Once this is done, open the folder where you just extracted this, click on the address bar and type CMT. This will open the command prompt right from the ADB directory. Once this is done, connect your smartphone to your PC and then in the command prompt, type ADB devices. Now you will have to authorize your PC on your smartphone and voila! you're accessing your smartphone. This may not work at the first attempt, so you may have to type the same command ADB devices again. Okay, now it's time to download Xiaomi Debloater. Again, the link is on the screen and also in the description. Now, GitHub is slightly confusing for first time users, so let me walk you through it. When you open the link, scroll down a bit till you find download the executable.jar from here. Once you click on that, you will be redirected to another page where you'll have to click on Xiaomi ADB Fastboot Tools.jar to download it. Finally, download and install the Oracle Java SE Development Kit from the link appearing on the screen and also in the description and this will let you open the jar file. Okay, now that we have done our basic work, it's only a matter of minutes before we end up with a bloat-free Xiaomi smartphone. Now on the screen, there's a bunch of apps that you may consider uninstalling. There's also an exhaustive link in the description. Remember to not delete Mi Browser, Weather and Wallpapers as they may actually break your smartphone. The bottom line 
is to remove the apps that you think are not of much use to you. And in case you don't want an app like downloads, make sure that you download a substitute from Google Play like Google's own file manager. Once you're done selecting the apps, hit uninstall and you will be done with the process. You can then close the debloater and then just go on with your life bloat free. So there you have it, two simple methods to remove bloat pair from your Mi UI 12 smartphone. If you found this video useful, do let us know in the comments and also remember to double check whatever you're doing before hitting uninstall. And that being said, for all things tech, log on to gadgets360.com.